Hi Roscoe here. I'm going to do another PvP pet battle video. I'm going to use the Mining Monkey, which is from Dead Mines. Um, I'm combining it with a Flaming Moth, which has this Nimbus, and then Widget the, the Departed. Um, yeah, I'll stick with this. Um, I've not tried it out. Essentially, the, the synergy here is just that hit chance from this moth. There's a few pets that have it. Uh, maybe this could be better. Yeah, actually, maybe this will be better. Because foreboding curse and the boat, or was it the banana barrage, will probably be better than the flaming moth. Okay. I'm going to start with my flaming moth. This little bling, I wouldn't mind that at all. I've got a bad matchup. I've got a bad matchup against the little bling with this, this guy. Cool, let's hope that he doesn't have. The bling a drone gift package. Went for it off the bat. I wouldn't have to stay in. I'm gonna use my cocoon strike here. Yeah, he's played that well. Okay, it's going to be quicker. I'm not going to be able to get the strat off. Yes, I am. Yeah, why not? Hammer set on the spirit claws. I just really hope I win the, the coin toss here. Unfortunately for the monkey... Maybe the monkey will get a match up against that. That fragment of anger. I'm going to go for my prowl into the... Wow, we're both going for it. Surely that mine hits harder. <laughs> Does it hit harder? Crikey. I should have gone for my devourer. Just keep spamming this. Yeah, I should have definitely gone for the devourer. Um, I haven't really give, like, given much time to this team. I have got a SS Digrat now, actually. Let's get this down. I'm gonna get my going berserkers up. Oh yeah, I think I misplayed that guy. In reality, he should get the, the kind of the damage on me here. Wow, <laughs> lucky! That was very lucky, actually. Um, I will try it again. The ominous with the ominous flame, actually. I have the new team. Has it got that or that? I'm going to stick to that. Am I? 
yeah, I mean, that's, that's a really good hard kind of counter for uh, any kind of mechanical then. So, I'm going to call this... Monkey... I don't know, do I want a, a more imaginative name than Monkey Madness? Nah. Having the the Spirit Claws buffed, it really makes you kind of swing towards that. It's like, well, I could use the Mining Monkey, or super buff spirit cores. In reality, obviously, um, in reality, probably the the Berman, but I, I mean, I've, I've played that before, the crazy trick that um, is just ridiculous. Cool. Let's see what he does the cat is the, the biggest problem for me actually let's get the Nimbus up now we know his strat Is going to be able to get the rake off on me, which will be really good use. Um, cool, I'll get the kill on him, and I'm going to get a free hit off on something. I've got the good match up against the mechanical there. Most certainly. Let's get a nice brief here. It's gonna go for AOE. Okay, I've got some Nimbus. I'm gonna just get go this straight off the bat, just in case for the stun. Now this, and then another one. This is the kind of thing where it's going to hit really hard. There we go. That worked pretty much as well as I could have wanted it to. There's nothing I can do now, though. Look okay, at here, I think that stays that buff, actually, so... Okay, the foreboding curse to go down on him. Yeah, still, still got the crit from when he died. I don't know if I'm gonna get this win. One five seven is going to take me to. Yeah, I think I can get. No, I can't. I don't think. I mean, either way, I don't think I'd have done that. Try this once more. Should I? What's this guy? What's he got? A 
a shot again. I think my 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 preoccupation of getting the Nimbus up probably is just hamper me. Yeah, so I have got an SS one now. Is that the PP? Sneaky Mama, new MVP. No. That's weird. Let me try the Foe Reaper as well. This guy definitely looks to be fun. The yeah, Aerotune is the, the ability that makes it a nice strong kind of pet. I'm going to start a widget now. I'm just going to plow straight into some spirit claws. Yeah, it's helps not to be low enough for this to work. I guess I could probably win the toss. Still, unless I miss, I'll get the kill on him. Yeah, that's that's the smart move to, to go bring him in. Go for that AoE. Yeah, I'm guessing I'm putting my faith in the monkey. Just go for damage. Just go for damage. I need to hit high. I need to get this up first. Yes, yeah, the fact is that that pet is just so kind of. Average. I'm gonna go in Berserkers and then Banana, bar banana Barrage. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to make this guy that viable other than playing my, um, my turkey team. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll um treat Mining Monkey to the the turkey to right. Um turkey Yes, it doesn't really matter too much. Uh Mining Monkey on you go. That was really this is a good ability. I was really going for it. I'd put that in. But no, I kind of want to spam all attack. Um, save as. Banana Rama, is that you spell Banana Rama? 
it is today. Yeah, so this this team is kind of set up for um, 50 percent hit users, and it works very very well. Um, here's the cat against Turkey. As long as I've got the speed debuff, it's going to be okay. The way he plays, I think I will, unless he remembers the the morning monkey in the the top there. It's the clone dance of this team as well that kind of makes it a, a very kind of strong team. I guess the teams that the team I was using was hampered by the fact it had that one undead, but it didn't have. I mean, the mechanical and the um, undead that they had. Okay, a blind team. Actually, this is quite a. If he if they start with um, I think the moon moon does actually reduce the effectiveness of my team. But if they start and go for the block, I imagine they're going to go for cool darkness. Even be running it. Um, I I'm gonna get the speed decrease up now. It hits through blind, which is really quite neat. Let's watch the turkey. It's worth me actually getting the stun on him here, so he can't moon dance. get the lucky dance up and whilst he is kind of preoccupied with the speed I am more interested in my banana garage I know that a blind is coming. Let's just go for it. I mean, yeah, the dazzling dance factor that they've got doesn't help me too much. I'll go to this guy. I'm going to get the temple and I'll move up again. His poison fan doesn't hit very hard. He's gonna kill me though. Uh, time to lucky dance again. Let's go for the stun here. I mean, the blind is going to come in, but I'm still going to have that 50% chance. Going to be quicker. No, I want to utilize this guy. Come on, hit hard. There we go. <laughs> He's not going to be able to survive that. Shift the punch. 
Yeah, so essentially these these two pets are my favourite combo probably for any kind of 50% hit hit chance kind of ability. So I've got loads of these kind of ones that have been added on. That's a lot of good ones. Um, so Banana Rama works obviously with it as well. It's super super hard. Yeah, so that's kind of the, the mining monkey mix success. Uh, I think I I don't know how viable using it with Nimbus is. I do think perhaps using kind of your your lucky dance or the, the uncanny luck that the, the the pig one has is probably going to be a more viable strategy. And I think Lenoka called it and said. Oh yeah, well, Roscoe will probably run the infinite hatching turkey and the, the mining monkey, and I have. But it's just because this this is one of my favourite combos. Uh, I really like it. It's clone dance. With the, the speed kind of decrease, and then that hit onto the raw crazy hard hitting abilities. It just like it works really well, and the mining monkey is gonna work really well with it. So, um, thank you for for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Um, probably just go back to kind of using regular teams, not trying to shoehorn these kind of new guys in quite so much. I am gonna try and use the SS dig rat at some point. I think this could be quite a fairly handy pet to have. So I'll, um, I'll see you in the, the next video and thank you for, for watching.